Stand up, mister. Or I was just jockeying you, boy. Hey, now hold it. That's enough. Hey, Jim. Now, if you're going to stay on here steady, you're going to have to learn how to take a little ribbon. Oh, we're just one big happy family. Who asked you to butt in? Uh, I think you did. Look, you're being top hand don't mean beans to me. Now, get out of my way. Hold on now, Jim. I think I'll weigh you a little. Well, what do you think? Kind of plain, ain't they? The price wasn't. What'd you do, blow your whole pay? Darn near. Well, to your feet. Well, the way I figured is, if I'm nice to them, then they'll be nice to me. Hey, you know what? You're wasting your time at this ranch. You ought to get a job at the newspaper in town. Is she that pretty? Oh, well, she just got a face like an angel and everything else to go with it. Hardly worth a second glance. Well, he didn't do any real damage. Good thing he landed on your head. Uh, he won't give you any more trouble. He's just scared of me. That's, uh, just at least, that's one of them. Just, that's only one. Look at me, chasing, chasing stampeded cattle in my underdrawers. Why, I ought to... Travis? Huh? Your hat. Oh. Well, I just can't let you do it, Travis. I can't let you keep this beautiful lady all to yourself. Jim. Well, just in case my friend here forgot to mention it, him being so bashful and all, his name is Trampus. Trampus, this is Sally Ann. Sally Ann, this is Trampus. Hello, Trampus. Hello, Sally Ann. I, uh... I even milked a cow. No. Don't you tell nobody. I won't. You been eavesdropping? Don't have to. Got a Dutch uncle, Jim? Somebody ought to talk to you like one. Might as well be me. Polly seat? I know Jim's a hand, but he's also a friend. I'm going with you. You're not going anywhere. Now look, Trampus. Shiloh means just as much to me as it does to you. You just try and stop me. Hey, what the? I'm all right. Look, I just got a little dizzy. I... Oh, sure, sure, you're all right. Why, you can lick your weight in mountain lions. Only thing is, you can't stand up. Now, get back in the bunk. Well, uh, don't let him scare you off now, Sally Ann. I mean, I know Travis looks mean and ugly, but, uh, well, when you get to know him, why, he's just downright lovable. Oh, I tell you, Travis, that's... My kind of woman. <laughs> that sounds familiar. No, 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 no. I, I mean it. That's what you said about uh, Esther Lita, that Fandango dancer in Laramie. Yeah, well, that was, that was just my hot blood talking. Let us talk it again. Come on, let's cool off with a cold beer. Well, I guess I'll be riding back to Shallow. Our day tomorrow. Still got that herd to move. Travis? I'll, uh, I'll ride back with you. All right. Uh, I found myself a family. And I've been right at home ever since. Now, how did you happen to meet Trampus? What made you think of him? Well, he's a top hand at Shiloh, about the best friend I got. Race you back to Shiloh? You're on. Come on, Buck. Yeah.